Hello, this is film number seven. It's got nothing to do with my theatre work in America and it's all about my niece's visit to New York and I'd hoped it would have all sorts of extraordinary shots in it. I'm afraid they're all in the wrong order, but here they are. And it starts off with my niece's, uh, the day after she arrived, being in one of uh, New York's parks where the cherry blossoms were beginning to fall. <laughs> Well, now I'm going to address uh, myself to uh, you, uh, my niece, uh, for the rest of this little film, as it's really made for you to watch. And as you'll quickly realize, uh, the film is all recorded in rather an odd order, I'm afraid. I think the cherry blossoms were filmed um, on the, your second or third day here. But here we are, in fact, on one of the last evenings uh, in my street, uh, looking up at the Empire State Building, which on the, the second evening, in fact, you may remember we, um, we went over the road to a sort of absolutely typical American diner, and uh, we were talking then about your plans for the week. And I just include this bit of film of a yellow cab here to swing us round to the, the diner, which you may remember we went to fairly late at night when you must have been fairly jet-lagged still. Uh, this is a shot um, at the end of your stay, which I just include just to remind you of the, the length of um, the bits of film and the length of time you had here. But anyway, here's the diner which uh, we sat in and... Uh, you may remember we, we talked about your trip to Virginia and how we were going to arrange that. And about a gallery that you were going to be going to. And here you are. Well, I mean, one of them, and this is just the thought, and this was relevant to the relationship side, was of balancing your soul. Zero is the unmanifest, yeah? Huh. Uh, you'll have realised now that uh, this film isn't going to have many dramatic uh, you know, moments in it. A very badly lit uh, yellow cab on... Uh, what? It's yellow. Actually, it's borderline beige today. Um. Here we are, however, uh, in a cab going uh, downtown. I can't quite remember when this was, but fairly early on, I think after our night out to the jazz club with Sharon. And to see her show. Manhattan, Manhattan. Which um, you've managed to discover that they have in America. Not many people know about it. Uh, Tough diner. And here we are back at my place after you'd come back from West Virginia. Mm. Probably sitting down and just being, just, just, just seeing just beautiful landscapes, really. I drank with her, we had some food. Uh, both her friends came to pick me up, which was really, really lovely of them. And uh, we went back and um, met all the horses and had a walk down by the stream and through the woods and um which doesn't sound bad no it's would change your perception of it as well like subtleties like that um well wherever you are it just has a slightly different flavor you know of you know it could be the same genre of tree it could be a whole woods of this particular tree that you might find in England, in Italy. But of course, it's not. It's usually not the same tree. Like this. No, as soon as you, I'll give you the film, okay. because there won't be time to. Um... Sure. No, no, no. Have from that picture there back to you. 
Thank you very much indeed. That's great. Got it. Thank you. Well, I'm sure that's pretty. Yes, we still open for us indeed. Giamma Giacomo. Giamma Giacomo. Italian. Where are you from? Where are you from? And here we are, your last in Manhattan. Uh, with me once again showing off uh, the Empire State Building as though I owned it, but it's just been such a part of my home since I moved to America. Everywhere I've lived, there's been a view of it from my windows, and uh, I just so wanted you to be a part of that as well. And we're now looking at the Statue of Liberty. Statue of Liberty? Which, um, which has got some dubious mythology surrounding it due to exactly why the French gave it to the America. Oh, uh, tell me, I have forgotten about that. What was it? Um, it dates back to some kind of um, uh, the, the actual a picture. Of, you know, I mean, you're going also into getting the thing over here must have been. I mean, how on earth did they get it here? Let's get the Empire State Building. Let's go over here. I know there was a huge thing because when it came, I mean, I can't remember what year of whatever it came, but they didn't exactly have a, a big boat. And it came in bits or something. I know it's it was a huge thing. Well, this film was actually supposed to start with me arriving monumentally at the airport. We had a bit of trouble, so this film is actually starting here at the quasi end. So here we are in Little Italy. Except we're not in Little Italy, but this would be just the voice thing over it. So when there's film of you walking down the road in Little Italy, uh, you, know, I you see. can say. In okay, the... and here we are in Little Italy. Schism within our family. Isms or schisms? Oh, well, I'm American, so I would say schism. Well, how do you, how would you pronounce it? What is schism? It's like a schism. It's S C H I S M. Okay, well, split. thanks for clarification. A schism. Oh right, okay. Kind of like what, split within a uh, firm process. Well, you, you know, you could, you know, you could get a paper schism when you cut your finger on it. Speaking of which, okay. Now, one thing. 